me folks and welcome to another toy review today's toy review will be the smurfs um i'm gonna be remastering the smurfs video because well it wasn't that good in the first place and now my voice has changed so we can uh do it seriously but whatever um i'm still i'm not gonna be making any more toy reviews you guys all know that i hope you guys know i'll probably have a big talk about that because well, they're not making very many views, and they're dying, and all that stuff. I'll have to get to it in another video, but yeah, let's get started on the Smurfs. I don't have a video in it because, um, or a commercial, because I already reviewed these, and, and I probably won't have a commercial in it, because it's just toys. Why not? Um, so let's start with number one, because it's the closest to us. Um, this is the Chef Smurf, I guess. I don't know any of the names. Um, these are 1980s and 1970s toys. Oh, I should say, uh, 1970 to 1980s toys. Uh, cause that would make more sense. Um, but the, yeah, this is a chef. Uh, he's got a big chef hat on and, and, uh, he's testing out some ingredients or whatever uh, with his sh uh, wooden spoon, uh, which looks like a dog shit on it. So, yeah, he's, you know. Yeah, that's the chef. Not much to him. Got buttons, little details like that. But most of them have details like that. Uh, let's look at this one. Uh, I've always liked this one because it's really cool, I guess. Like, it's really funny, I guess. You got a little re yellow bird there, and he's got, like, a little leaf on the side of his, his hat. And he's got a little gun. And he's all spooked out. It's pretty cool, I guess. Um... Anyway, there you go. There's the there's the bird Smurf. I guess I don't know. I guess we should call him call him names. Let's look at the only female character I have in this whole collection. Um, this is I forget her name. I guess you guys can tell me in the comments. Let me see if if I can find her on her on her feet. Oh, this was 1982. Made in uh. Portugal, that's pretty cool, um, yeah, judging by it was made by something, uh, but it's really nice looking, it's really cool, so that's all I can say about that, it's really nice, it's got, going out for Easter, it would be a really cool thing for Easter time, but it's not Easter time, so, yeah, there you go with her pink costume on and all that, Alrighty, we'll put her aside. Um, let's look at the cow, the cowboy dude. Uh, cowboy smurf. Uh, this is one of my favorites. Uh, because he is so fucking detailed and cool. Um, this one is actually 1981. 1981 smurf toys. They're all different. They're all from different collections and different, um, different packs. So we're, this is just a mix because my like I only got to collect the only like a limited of them. Anyway, he's got like a red red thing on or um, pants, and he's got a rope around his hand or his arm, and a nice black belt and a scarf, red scarf or bandana maybe, um probably a bandana, and he's got a cool ass hat, pretty damn cool. One of the best looking ones out of all of them is this guy right here. To be honest with you. Alright, let's look at the one that's sitting on the pillow. We call this one Pillow Smurf. Uh, what's, what, when was this one made? 1975. <whistles> 1975 this one was made. Um, the eye, the eyes aren't too good. Um, they're very blurry on camera. I don't know. Not not anymore, I guess, but when you get it, like, bring it up to the camera, it looks like shit. Just by looking at it afar, the eyes are crappy. But, uh, that's all, that's the only complaint about this one. Uh, everything is painted well, except there's little splotches of blue paint on the pillow. I don't know if you guys can see that. There you guys go. So, anyway, blue, uh, splotches of paint. We'll call them, uh, Smurf Pillow. And now we got the one that's diving with a uh, floaty around its belly or something like that. I don't know. Uh, floaty around his body with a swimsuit. Um, I have no idea what's up with his face. 
He looks like he's just seen a ghost. Or he's breathing in and he's going underwater. I don't know, I guess this would be a cool bath toy or something like that for your kids. I have no clue. <laughs> we'll call him swimming, uh, swimming surf, Smurf. Uh, let's look at Bowling Smurf because he's cool. Uh, except he's got red paint all over his hand. Um, I guess that's all right. They could have glued the ball to his hand, and then that would have made a lot more sense. Uh, but I guess it'd probably slowly break off over time, and he wouldn't be able to hold it anymore. Um, this one's alright. Just a normal Smurf with a red bowling ball. Just going through the bowling course and all that. Just very random characters. Just random. Now let's look at the King Smurf. Uh, this is not even Grandpa, the Grandpa Smurf, so I don't even know who the hell this is. Um, he's got a marsh, uh, mushroom stick thing. Um, a nice, um, crown crown smurf hat i guess and a um can't remember what these what uh cape so yeah cape and his nice gold whatever yellow thing he's gold yellow smurf or yellow king smurf now let's look at when he was made uh i don't think it actually says all it says it was made in germany this one was made in germany and it looks a lot nicer than the other ones, I have to admit. Like, look at the paint job. Look at the paint job on his eyes. His eyes look really well done. His cape looks really well done. Everything looks really well done to this character and figure. Well, I don't know. I don't know if they, if you can call them characters or not. But anyway, let's look at the graduation Smurf because why not? Um, he's got like a brown graduation hat. Um. Got a graduation scarf and all that. Graduation paper. Um, a case. I don't remember that being in the graduation books. Uh, he's smiling. He's just happy to get out of that hell hole. He's got a really goofy ass face though. Like, look at it. Just look at it. There's my camera. My camera's not blurry now. So you guys can look at it up close. Goofy ass face. Anyway, there's uh, Graduation Smurf. Alright, let's look at um, uh, Sleepwalking Smurf, I guess. With his green hat thing. I guess he's in his pajamas, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. I never understood what he's doing. Is he touching? Like, what is he doing? Anyway, there's not much to say about this guy. Because, well, he's sleepwalking, I think. Uh, at least I think so. I hope. I hope so. Hope he's not doing something weird. Um, he's got his eyes shut, so you can't really talk much about him. Just that he's got a green, green thing on his hat. So there's um, sleepwalking Smurf. Um, we're getting to the cool ones. Um, let's look at uh, the coolest one, I guess here. That's we got left over the diving Smurf. Um, the diver Smurf. That's what we should say. Uh, he's got a diving suit on. He's got like this kind of cool spear thing that he's holding on. He's got some flippers, black flippers, uh, orange swimming, uh, um, uh, scuba, scuba suit. Um, he's got like a, he's still got his hat on and he's got a scuba mask and a snarkel. So <laughs> it's pretty funny just looking at him. Ugh, like, hmm. That's pretty cool. Let's look at um, the one, the last, the last two over here, and then we gotta look at these three. We should probably move them away from the pack. Move them over here. All right, let's look at painting Smurf. Um, look at this guy's face. He's got his tongue sticking out. He just looks like he's painting something weird. Um, he's there's some detail in his plate, in his painting plate. And he's got a paintbrush there, and he's just painting something. I don't know what he's exactly painting. Maybe he's painting um, yellow. Um, oh, I forget, I forget his name. Eh, we'll, we'll we'll keep going. Oh, uh, let's look at um, baseball Smurf. He's got a baseball. That ba that baseball is like the most detailed thing. Like, look at it. Just look at that. Pretty detailed for a Smurf toy. 
And he's got some... This is like the only one that actually has a stand. That's surprising. Um, when was this one made? Hong Kong. It was made in Hong Kong. That's all I, I can find about it. I don't see a date. I don't see when it was made, but it's probably the 1980s, just by looking at it. But I have no clue. He's got his sh red shirt on, his red um, shorts on. He's got his uh, baseball glove, and he's all ready to play. So, yeah, he just stands up like this. But he does fall over. So you have to see if you can get his his stand up fit like work. But he lo he looks pretty damn cool. Just looking at him, so we can add him to the the pack. Um, let's look at injured Smurf. Injured Smurf is something to see. Uh, he's got some cross thing on. It. I I'm, I don't know if this is a medic Smurf or no. I guess it's an injured Smurf because that's a bandage uh, or band aid. Oh, um, he's got like a yellow thing to hold his arm up. Um, and he's got a walking stick. He looks pretty more beat up. He's got band-aid around his foot so I don't know what he did but um he was doing something in his face his face is something to admire oh uh, now let's go fishing smurf because fishing smurf is just he's got a fishing rod and fishing stick and whatever you call it and he's just smiling and having a great time fishing wah yeah wah Probably put this on your pond. If you ever have a pond, you could probably put this guy just at the end. About that. Uh, last off, but not least, um, we have uh the bad, the villain dude. I forget his name, but uh, he has seen better days. Obviously, look at his arm. I don't know if the camera can handle his arm, but it is bad. His back is bad. I don't even know what was on him, but it, it's like spoiled milk or something shit like that. His face has been like rubbed, like it's been put on the pavement and just scraped. Um, he's got a big stash right there, but he he has seen better days. I guess I think this is actually from McDonald's, to be honest with you. I have no clue what this is from. Uh, I'm I'm very I'm fairly sure this is from um. The Smurfs. I just I included him in the video because of his the look of him. Like he looks like the villain from the show. And you can the only articulation he's really got. He put his legs up and down. Um, his arms can move. He's a he's an actual figure. Like he can turn his head. Very stiff stiff though. But anyway, you can have him the way you want him. Um. But yeah, there's the collection of Smurfs. There's the collection right there. That's the last time I'll be bringing these guys up in the channel. And this will probably be... I think there'll be like a couple more toy reviews left. But I'm, I'm like... There probably ain't going to be very many. Uh, we have... Like I said, we have... These guys, which will be next. But... Uh, that's basically it for the franchise of uh, toy reviews. I got a couple other stuff to review, but barely anything cool anyway. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe, comment, and like. And bye for now.